In today's video, I wanna share with you three foolproof sides that pair great with a rotisserie chicken that are perfect for busy weeknights. Plus, make sure to watch my canned vegetable hack. You will never want to eat them any other way. Hi, I'm Laura, and if this is your first time here, welcome. On this channel, I share lots of family-friendly recipes that will help you get dinner on the table real quick, any night of the week, and sometimes, like you, I also have minimal bandwidth at the end of the day, so a rotisserie chicken totally solves my what's for dinner dilemma. So if that's your jam, hit that red subscribe button with the bell so you'll be the first to know when a new recipe video is released every single week. My first side of recommendation is roasted frozen broccoli. Yes, you heard that right. No more bland steamed broccoli. You're gonna let the oven do the work for you in just 20 minutes and you can go do something else. Take that frozen broccoli, you're gonna spread it on a sheet pan, drizzle some olive oil over the top and season it well. Below this video, I'm gonna link my four ingredient magic seasoning that is gonna transform any veggie, I promise. Okay, so now take that frozen broccoli and roast it at 450 in the preheated oven for about 20 minutes. Out it comes and now you have an epic side for your chicken that tastes really great. Another favorite is this Olive Garden copycat side salad. What I love about it is that you can make it in a few minutes or make it ahead and store it in the fridge up to two days without the dressing and have it ready for dinner. Every bite is so delish and it's super easy to make by chopping up some green lettuce, coarsely dicing some bell peppers, then you can add some crispy cucumber, which you can cut as big or small as you like. The red onion, I like to cut it up small, but it's totally optional here. And then there's something about black olives in our salad, juicy cherry tomatoes that make it feel so fancy. To take the salad to restaurant level, you've got to add some croutons in there and Parmesan cheese, of course. Right before you serve it, add that vinaigrette, give it a good toss and dish it up for an epic side. This salad is one I often delegate to one of my teens to make while I'm getting the rest of the meal ready or doing something else. Now my final side is this simple hack that works with any canned vegetable. It's literally gonna transform them from plain to next level good. So first, you're gonna drain out the liquid and rinse the canned vegetables. In a pan, we're gonna heat up some olive oil. You're gonna add some garlic and saute it for 30 seconds until you can just smell it. Then add the canned vegetables and give them a stir. Now remember that magic veggie seasoning that I just mentioned earlier? I'm gonna use it again, of course. For every can of vegetables, I use about a half a teaspoon of the seasoning. Then I stir it, heat it all up for about two minutes. I'm telling you that these now have a crisp texture and they're full of flavor and pair great with your rotisserie chicken. Now, if using rotisserie chicken in recipes is your thing, hit that red subscribe button in this video is part of a rotisserie chicken series. So no matter when you find it, I'm gonna link below some awesome recipes and other shortcuts for you. See you next time.